Fabulous P4 at the end of the day. A remarkable end to that Grand Prix. Obviously, it's gone the wrong way for your teammate. How difficult was it to make that decision? Was it a, a decision that had to come from the cockpit or from the pit wall? Uh, I mean, look, I, I speak purely... I've, I've only heard through media Lando's race, but I, I speak purely on, on my race or my feeling is... I think that one, you know, I'm asking pit wall if, if the rain's getting heavier because this part of the track was more or less dry. It was the far part which was wet and that's we are the best reference for that so i said you know like turn five turn seven i'm i can't keep it on the track anymore so for me it was clear i said i, I need to come in the intel because uh turn seven i went off nearly close to the wall so it, it wasn't even a question for me i, I told the guys I, I need intel um so i think like normally it's we are the best judge for that because we are the one feeling the track but uh, again i'm not speaking about Lando's situation, but at least for me today, it was clear. And actually, in hindsight, probably one lap earlier was even better. So, you know, we still probably didn't perfect it, but uh, I think we, it was still the right call. We deserved a, a good result today. I mean, the, a great launch and then good defence, <laughs> comfortable defence against Lewis for most of that first stint. It was... Um, <laughs> it probably always looks more comfortable than it is. Uh, I think the... It's tough here because it's such a long run to turn one. So the launch was the second in phase, a way isn't too it? good. Yes, yes. And actually, I at one point I had to lift because I was going to lose the slipstream or something. So I lifted to tuck back in, and then I all the all the all the good work was undone. So um, maybe on another circuit that launch would have been more beneficial. But anyway, that was good. Then I lost positions and then gained. I think I got Alonso and Lewis back on lap one. So it was net even in the end, um, and then defended a bit. Some good passes, then Perez got me, so some good moments, some not good, but i uh, keen to keep working on it. Well, listen, he's shed a few tears today. You'll, you'll talk to him later, but yeah. in terms of these two races for the team, how much, how much optimism can you take from it? It's, I mean, from a team point of view, obviously, with, you know, the, <laughs> the more I stand here and speak to you guys, the more I understand that, you know, Lando's race was... Uh, uh, yeah, a bit of a disaster at the end. You know, it could have been, uh, by, the, by my understanding, a first or a second by the sound of it. So, um, you know, from a team, I think there's encouragement with performance. Obviously, there, there could have been more points today. But, yeah, um, we'll keep, keep looking at it. I think, personally, some moments were good, some not so. So I, I'm still, yeah, still eager to, to find the speed in the car. Um, I don't think it was a... As a comfortable weekend as Monza, certainly a bit bit more tricky and a bit compromised with Friday, so I don't think we ever really got back on top, on top of it, so try to keep working on it. Well done today, thank you. Thanks.